All right, all right, all right. Time to get things started. Um, a little late in the um, in the morning, but no time like the present, eh? So I was watching the uh, futures uh, this morning, and when I woke, we were down considerably. Um, and I was looking forward to that because uh, there's premiums um, in, in the options, and um, that's what I wanted. But uh, since then, the market has uh, turned around and come back. Um, think, and there it is. And look, it's putting in a little hammer here on the daily, which is uh, interesting. If we open up like that, then we may test that high. Um, what I'm watching is, yeah, you know, well, right now, these are the futures. Um, we're, we're in a downtrend, and really, I'm looking to make a lower low. Um, but um, th this sell-off uh, might be coming to an end or in a transition. Um, here, we're looking at the uh, futures, and here, we still have this downtrend, and... Um, I do feel well, we close that gap, but I'm thinking that um we still have a little more downward move. I mean, if we continue the trend, then yeah, you know, logic uh would dictate uh that uh we break that uh two seventy nine seventy one point, so we could watch for that. Uh, the momentum is fading on the daily. So we may open up about 11 points. If we opened up 10 or 11 points um, from the close, we'd be talking about roughly 70. So, yeah, that I mean, it's, it's not illogical. It would still uh, be consistent and then uh, trade down uh, for the day. I mean, yesterday we talked about uh, closing this gap, and the initial move was that shoot up, but it turned around and closed the gap anyway. And I believe that that is how we're going to trade today. Keep in mind also that we have uh, Fed minutes tomorrow and we have oil tomorrow. So could be a lot of traders just sitting on the sidelines and market makers are just bullying the market and moving it around and making opportunity for themselves. This is the 60 minute chart. And I think that we're gonna, at the very least today, do a last kiss right here. Um, so I'm thinking, or, or probably 53 we're looking at, um, 40, uh, 43.53. So that's really uh, what I'm expecting. And uh, we're just gonna take a quick look at the treasuries and the treasuries are trading off uh, right now. And it's putting in a, a divergence, which is what I was looking for. Is it a divergence? Let's open this bad boy up and just uh, see, get a better feel for it. It seems slightly divergent. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Momentum's fading on it. Could turn around. I would like to just see a couple of aggressive down days before we head up. This 30-minute uh, bar is very interesting on the 10-year. Uh, Fully engulfing. Would lead me to believe that uh, the, the interest rates are going to come down a little bit. But again, all this stuff goes out the window because the feds are... Uh, out there and we're waiting on them um oh look at tesla man 800 i don't even recall how long it's been since i've seen that um so anyway i'm not going to rip through everything because everything's just following the market um and uh, my opinions on them last night or yesterday morning haven't really changed so that's it for the morning meeting we got uh about 10 minutes before the market opens and Hope to hear from some people.